Jens Vogt featured in our Tour Down Under documentary, and whilst we were pestering him for his time, we thought we'd stretch our luck and ask for a closer look at his 2014 team bike. Trek Factory Racing took over the World Tour licence from Radio Shack Leopard at the end of last year, and the bike manufacturer used the team to show off its latest equipment. Jens is riding a team issue Madone 7. This comes with two options, the H1 and the H2. The former has a smaller head tube for a more aggressive racing position, and this is what Jens has opted for on his 60cm frame. There is an integrated speed sensor on the inside of the chainstay, which links up to his SRM head unit. A full Shimano Di2 11-speed group set is used by almost the entire team, bar Fabian Cancellara, who still opts for the mechanical version. It's all fairly standard stuff, apart from the SRM-equipped cranks, which are longer than normal 177.5mm, and also the extra satellite shifters located on the bars. Chainrings and cassette were the more common 39.53 and 11-25 tooth. The battery for the group set is hidden inside the seat tube. Bontrager is a company that was bought by Trek many years ago, so it's not a surprise to see plenty of their products on display. The wheels are the Aeolus 5 models and they also supply the bottle cages, saddle plus the bars and stem. The latter were incidentally aluminium rather than the more commonly found carbon that we tend to see on pro bikes these days. Last but by no means least, German company Schwalbe provide the team with grip in the form of their one tubular tyres. Marcel Pinto stands at 6 foot 2 and rides a large 57.5 cm frame. The extremely aero frame is claimed by Giant to save 12 to 36 seconds over...